Well, Sarah Cook of GravityGlassStudio.com. <laughs> and tell us how you're a young person just graduated from college in the arts and you live in a city that there's more cows than people. And you said, how the hell am I going to get a job in the arts? And you figured that out, didn't you? Yeah, I made my own job. <laughs> wow, that's terrific, man. And, and so what is Gravity Glass uh, Gravity Glass Studio do for folks? Uh, it provides truly handmade uh, artisan glass and hemp jewelry. Wow. Uh, so you're making handmade jewelry for people, customized, huh? Uh, yeah, everything is actually made to the wearer specific size. Uh, ah. So when you order a bracelet or a necklace from me, you actually, you know, you're going to say Measure. exactly how long you want right. your necklace or your bracelet to be. So it fits you. <laughs> wow. So in other words, when you graduated, you were looking and there's no, the cows weren't hiring, right? <laughs> <laughs> you can't fill out an application and get a job as a studio <laughs> artist. For, Especially so. as an artist, yeah, right? Yeah. And, and so now, but you're keeping life together as you're starting because you've only been at this for a year or two out of college, right? Right. And right. so it's growing all the time and you see maybe in another year, you'll be able to do it and give up your day job. And yeah. what is your day job that's actually a night job? Yeah, my day job is actually a night job. Uh, I work overnights at Home Depot. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> they make you comb your hair different? No? no customers in the store, so I get to keep my mouth. <laughs> well, that's great. See, with the suit, I like that. I, they threw me off TV shows and everything when I started wearing my TV shoe. Actually, even home shopping I used to do. They threw me off the air there, and I said, no, this is me. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and that's what it is. So now you have a place to express what's really you in your work and share it with other people, don't you? Yes. <laughs> wow. What could be better than that? I mean, it, and it's a struggle. It's not easy. You just don't put one website and make a zillion dollars, do you? No, you you know you, it's uh there's been a learning curve. You yeah. have to learn uh, SEO, you know, search engine optimization, right. and learn how to actually show up when people search for things. Uh, I also use uh, online selling platforms like the Handmade on Amazon that just ah, came right. out. Yeah, that's that's where my sales of increase the most really is by getting so you're all also on etsy too i'm on etsy too but i i've you know from my experience with it i've seen that there's more sellers than there are buyers i see yeah yeah not everybody knows what you mean when you say oh yeah i sell on etsy well, what is that right, <laughs> you know exactly right. amazon you can relate amazon, to that. everybody knows amazon yeah yeah no, and that's true. I mean, Etsy, they do about a billion dollars, but still, that's why Amazon is there. You know, this is big. People are selling on the Internet, you know, and, and, and people like you. I mean, see, I could buy something unique from you instead of going into the jewelry store or whatever and getting something that five million other people are going to get. Exactly. And then you don't need five million customers. You just need a few hundred, right? And you're okay. Right. Yeah. Right. And so now you see yourself as making a living on this eventually, right? Yeah, the way things are going, I definitely think I can. Yeah. You know, and that's my big dream. Wow. And, you know, to get to the point where I can't keep up with orders on my own and where I'll be able to hire other artists. Artists who can't get work. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, actually, when I, was in, when I was in school, they made us read this book called Art and Fear. Oh, and it, it was kind of pr to prepare us for the art world after graduation. And there was a statistic in there that stood out to me that 5% of studio art graduates, only 5% of studio art graduates will be producing work five years after graduation. Ooh, ooh. And, you know, that that's terrible. That's I don't want... Hurts. And yeah. we need that creativity. To what we... Yeah. So I want, you know, I want people to see that, you know, hey, five years later, I'm still doing it yeah. and I'm inspiring other people to do it. And Absolutely. Yeah. Because I think before the Internet, you used to have to get your work into Walmart only, you know, now. Yeah. And like craft fairs and right. stuff. That's another good Right. A good way to sell your work and get out there, but it, you know, it's yeah. it's a lot of work. <laughs> but now you could go international and everything. Exactly. By just sitting up in Cowsville, New York, wherever this is, right? <laughs> yep, good old Bernard's Bay. Bernard Bay. Is it near the water? Are you on the water? Yeah, we're we're right off uh, the shore of Oneida Lake. 
Ah, I see. Well, it must be wonderful up there. So instead of having to move down to the city in New York City or something like that, man, you can stay there by the water and the cows and work your heart out, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's wonderful. And you say that the Internet, also you're there to learn new things. It teaches you how to make new products and everything just by searching yeah. The the online glass artist community is huge, and everybody. You know, what was that word again? Always... Huge. Did huh? you say huge? Ah, uh, Billy <laughs> Juzillo. <laughs> huge. Um, yeah. He. Uh, but yeah, the online glass artist com communities it's it's huge. You know, people uh, people are constantly sharing new techniques, and you know, you're constantly learning from each other, wow. and it's like a big back and forth between artists. So in other words, there's a way to, uh, uh, no matter what you're doing, you could really learn how to almost do anything from the free help that's available. You don't have to hire a consultant, right? Right. Right. Wonderful. Well, it's so nice to talk to you, and I'm so happy that someone is able to like, share their love with the world and their products and, uh, and share it with other people all over the world just because you figured out how to use the Internet and you didn't have to hire some weird techie guy right <laughs> <laughs> yeah. you can do it yourself and to find you it's gravityglassstudio.com and you find sarah Gravity cook Glass there right <laughs> and just all the wonderful julie and the glass will keep her making glass and get to gravityglassstudio.com thank you so much sarah nice right, to meet you. you have fun up there with the cows i will <laughs>